So this church is across the road from the Castle Bar, which is in Bandon, but there's no indication what church it is. So I'll have a look. They've got a car there, so somebody might come out and ask me what I'm doing. But um, I presume it's still used as a church. It's got a graveyard. Graves that probably go back to the 1800s. What denomination is, I don't know. In general, overall condition, it looks quite good. So maybe I was wrong. About the year 1936, age 75, 61, 81, something. That's not that far back, it's 30 years ago. So apparently, this could be actually a Protestant church, but don't quote me on that. Because they put these trees there, and apparently there's a ward off evil spirits I mean, so generally the building's in pretty good condition I mean obviously the windows have been changed or they could have perspex on them to protect them but the reason I think it could possibly be a Protestant church, they don't have very ornate windows, but they're difficult to see, aren't they, because they cover them up. And what's going on inside? Well, I think it's definitely Catholic with that cross in the window there. I mean, there's a couple of patches in the roof, so we'll see. Someone's maintaining the building anyway. Yeah, it's got mesh on there. Probably just stop the birds flying in and things, you know, the mesh. So that's the original church we were in, in another video, if you could scroll back a bit. That's called St Patrick's Church, that one. Bloody huge, isn't it? So, uh, this one I'm not really sure. Brown doors. <laughs> it's got security on there, security light anyway. So a will a bit of fencing with a fancy lock there. It seems to have a basement. I mean, this video is probably good if you're from Band and you played in this graveyard when you were a kid or attended the church or you're just interested in churches and graveyards. That's an interesting bit of architecture, isn't it? It's quite a big church overall, it's big. I don't know what was originally there. But as you see, you get like a panoramic view of the town. And so that was the entrance for wheelchair people in wheelchairs, you know. And so one time the building was floodlit, maybe for special occasions. So there seems to be a clock there, see if we can get it in the picture. And they're saying it's 25 past one. I have to look at my watch, I'll tell you now. It stopped. <laughs> so, um, let's get an image of the clock, which is very badly beaten, actually, that clock. I mean, 
very difficult to see the, the numbers on it. So there is an entrance there. If we go down these stairs, we see if we can find the name of the place. So we're looking for a name. There are St. Peter's Church, Bandon United, of Bandon Union of Parishes, Church of Ireland. So it's, this is a Protestant church, yeah. And um, the Reverend Dennis. So there we have it. St. Peter's Church and um, it's in Bandon.